Good afternoon, everybody. So the other day, I was with my dad. We were going to McDonald's to buy some ice cream. And ice cream costs a dollar. And something my dad told me on the side was that in his day and age, ice cream used to cost 50 cents. And you know, that got me thinking. But the main point that I wanted to bring out from this story was that the value of things today are not the same as they were 10 years ago. Would actually, uh, this actually relates back to the subject that I will talk about, which is increasing SMU's school fees. We live in an ever-increasing and more complex world than ever before. And as a result, SMU needs to equip its students to be prepared for the changing future. The three ideas that are going to be covered under the school fees will be uh, improving our current infrastructure physically. So SMU is well known for its collaborative culture. We know that students work together in group study rooms on projects. So this money will be allocated towards developing new facilities. Second of all, we will also be looking towards attracting new talent. With this money, we'll be able to attract new professors and have guest speakers who will come in and speak for providing broader perspectives. And lastly, we will also be investing in new software programs that will help equip our online curriculum through eLearn and other online databases. So these are the three encompassing ideas that will be covered under our increasing school fees. Thank you. Speakers, projector, and aircon. What do they have in common? You do not appreciate them until they stop working. <laughs> so I have this story where I have to show a video to the class, and the speaker, they were not working, and it was very difficult for the class to hear, and I couldn't show them what a funny video I have. So the part of the story is that we should always be prepared. So in order to be prepared, I have something new here. It's called the sauna. It's a funnel, but it works as a speaker. It has three properties. It's light, it's powerful, and it's environmentally friendly. It's light. It's so light that sometimes when I hold it, I forget that I'm holding it. <laughs> Secondly, it's powerful. It's made of this new plastic. It's so dense that sound, when sound hits it, it can travel five times further. And with that, you can broadcast videos, music to everyone, and they will be able to hear your message, your music, your video. Last but not least, it's environmentally friendly. It's environmentally friendly, and this is the direction we're all going towards because of global warming and everything else. So we should do our part for the environment and purchase products that are sustainable. So with these three properties, I have something to add on. This is a patent pending product. So, before the patents get approved, I recommend that you guys buy it first. If not, the price will be much higher. So, light, powerful, and environmental friendly, you should get this at $49.99. Uh, you can have a try and have a demo to see how loud it really sounds. But be careful, loud sounds may affect your hearing. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so as you all know, Pokemon Go has took the world by storm. In 2016 alone, there were over 500 million downloads. <coughs> However, gathering feedback from the various users, we have decided to incre increase some updates to the game. So here are our three main upgrades. Okay, firstly, introduce trading. Okay, imagine you're a businessman or a student. You don't have time to travel. How are you going to get a tourist base in the US? However, if you have friends traveling there, you are able to travel and gain more and gain the Pokemon that you once were not able to. Okay, secondly, you have 
battling. Currently, you can only battle at the gyms. However, with this new update, you'll be able to battle with your friends and it will increase the social element of the game. Okay, so lastly, we have the new addition of friends. You are able to add friends and look at their look at their up upgrades and look at their new Pokemons and check their progress. You can also talk to them. Who knows, you may be, you may be able to find your special one too. Okay, so thank you. <laughs>